My name is Charlotte and I work in the Historic Clothing Department at the New Canaan Museum and Historical Society in Connecticut. Last week we received a donation to the museum in the form of this 1952 Seal Chapman evening gown. It was worn by the donor's mother to her own engagement party at the Pickwick Arms Hotel in Greenwich, Connecticut, which stood until 1972. Because it was such a last minute surprise, we almost didn't include it in the show, but look at how amazing she looks and we had to do some quick thinking. Here is the hotel, by the way. The dress is strapless and has an underlayer of purple that shows through the blue ruffles to create a unique shade, and my favorite part is the top layer that starts at the waist and cascades down the back, embroidered with flowers and leaves. Once we had built the mannequin out to fit the dress, we realized that she kind of looked a little bit flat. There's the purple, by the way. Um, so we decided to use a petticoat from our storage and create our very own DIY crinoline to fluff the dress out, and we ended up using this technique for both of our 1950s exhibit dresses, so there's a little bit of a secret. And as you can see, it makes all the difference. Anyways, Seal Chapman was a very big designer in the mid 20th century. She dressed all kinds of movie stars. The Met even has a few of her dresses. And because we got the dress so recently, we haven't been able to photograph it for the database. You know the whole drill with the backdrop. So I included some of the photos of the other designs that I found from the designer instead. These are the ones from the Met. And then here is Marilyn Monroe wearing one of her gowns as well as Debbie Reynolds and Elizabeth Taylor. So thanks for watching and let me know what you think.